It's beautiful out there. Shopping for a Halloween costume, you know, it can get expensive, but there are ways to create your own costume for just a couple bucks. Yeah, this morning we're checking in with Denise. She's live at St. Vincent Paul with the inside scoop on never, how you can score. Okay, Denise. I never thought you, of this idea. So Denise and I were chatting. We never realized that you could get such great costumes there. No, uh, Tracy, not at all. And I'll tell you what, you know, you're right up my alley with sending me in here because I've been finding things and challenging some of the people to go find something to go with it. Check this out. Now, look, I can be a queen, but here's my hatchet. So off with their heads kind of thing. But, you know, I mean, it's like 15 bucks for the dress. Um, you know, whatever for the hatchet. I'm sure you have something fake at home because nobody really, this is real. So no, nobody wants to carry this around. But check this out. Look at these fun boots. I mean, what could you do? Diana Ross with something like this? You come in, you pick them up, you find those. I mean, cowboy boots. I mean, you come in and you can go around and it's just regular normal stuff. But you could go in and you could find any kind of a costume, just one little thing. But they have things like, look at this. Look how cute this is. I did, none of the kids are actually in these. They were actually needed to actually go find costumes, just something easy to, but look how cute those are. I mean, it's just, there's all kinds of stuff. And just take a look at all these guys. Liz, they're adorable. So you've got all different kinds of, uh, turn around here and talk to me. How are you? What's your name? Meredith. Meredith? No. No? Wait, are you a pretty fairy? Uh, yeah. Are you a beautiful fairy? Can you spin around? Yay, look at that. You know, she's got the dress and the little wings. It almost looks like a dress that came, like, from a, a wedding or something. Oh, there she goes. <laughs> Come over here, sweetie. Are you supposed to be a little old lady? Mm -hmm. How does a little old lady talk? <laughs> oh, turn around and show them. Oh, she's a cat lady. Look at this. She's got little cats sticking out. Look at your little dress in your little walker. She's got the curlers in your hair. Are you supposed to look like your mom? <laughs> <laughs> What's your name? Samantha. Samantha, how old are you? Five. Five? Do you think you want to dress like this for Halloween? No. No? What do you really want to be? I don't know yet. <laughs> <laughs> Come over here, buddy. How about you? What are you doing? Yay. Good. Are you turn around here and let's look at the camera. Are you a pirate? Yeah. Yeah. Look at his little costume. It's just a little pair of shorts and a vest and a little ruffled shirt. Yeah. What's your name? Nada. What is it? Nada. Otto. Otto. Okay. And now, who's this? Do you know who this is? Yeah. He's, a, he's a tourist. Check him out. He's got his camera, you know, and it doesn't matter because he's not going to break it. He's got his water bottle, his hat. And his fanny pouch? I mean, where else can you go buy stuff like this but right here? Tracy Frank, it's just, I'm having a field day. I got a whole basket full. So wait till you see what we have coming up. I can't wait to do this. I like that little guy. He looks like he's you know, like a Hawaiian golfer. I know. You would never think for little ones. So any oh. age, you go get your Halloween costume. Go check it out. Thanks, Denise. Thanks. Appreciate it. Robin Jessica will bring you up to date on today's topic.